Hi guys, Alice Taylor here, and today we're going to have a look at the Callaway Apex Pro 16 irons. So I've just tested the normal Apex, and they were very, very impressive on performance. Um, very different look from the Pro. So a polished finish. Um, still looks very, very powerful in the back, but doesn't look as big and chunky. Sole isn't as wide. And certainly when I look at it from down above, you know, it looks much more like a player's club. So I've got 7 iron, uh, Project X 6.0 in this. I'm going to hit six real balls on flight scope. Um, it is November in Blackpool. Uh, having said that, the ball with the apex was long. So it's not hot, but there's no breeze at all today. But real ball flight, six real balls. Let's hit some, give you guys some feedback and see if Apex Pro might be a club end of 2015 going into 2016 that you might be looking to put in your bag. So like I said, when you put it down behind the ball, it really looks like a player's club. So for me personally, I love the look of that. I think it looks fantastic. Still feels quick off the face. Don't think it feels as lively as the Apex. I don't think this is aimed at the same market of player. <clears throat> you know, feels much, much softer off the face. It's forged as well, so it should feel softer. But, I mean, this feels more like a club that I've grown up with, only it's going to be a lot more forgiving than what I've grown up with. So first things on look and feel definitely tick the box for me. And good height. I mean, I'm only hitting seven iron here, but it's nice and high, flying well. That's it, three more. I'm just turning it over a little bit. Last couple. I'll be interested to see on the distances here, because this doesn't look anywhere near as long. No, it certainly isn't as long, but distance isn't the be all and end all for every golfer. Again, very good, just looks very consistent. <clears throat> you know, I mean, it's great that some of the modern clubs hit it a long way, but in theory, they can hit it too far. One last one with this. Yeah, I love the feel of that. I think that's, I think that's a lovely looking and feeling golf club. So let's see if it performs as good as it looks and feels. Okay, guys, so we look at the numbers. I mean, it's a club shorter than the Apex. I haven't looked at the lofts, but just as a guess, the Apex is going to be a stronger loft than the Pro. Um, for me, shortest carry of 162, longest 171. So again, good dispersion. I think for me, if I look at shot three, I think for me, the, the spin's probably a little bit off on that one. So if I were to hide that, it'd take the spin to kind of five and a half thousand, which is still a little bit on the low side. But again, I, I always think I tend to be a bit low. Uh, actually launched it a bit higher than Apex, I think, so at 21 and hit it 114. But again, some very, very impressive numbers with a seven iron. So having looked at some numbers with Apex Pro, I thought that was good. You know, like I said, I, I mean, it looked and felt very like a player's club, but didn't give up a massive amount of distance on one of those irons that are looking to hit it a long way. I mean, certainly I think if you're the guy who wants something very forgiving that bombs it, I think out of the Apex range, just the normal Apex 16 is the one. But if you're a better player looking for something that little bit softer, maybe looks a little bit more sleek, for me, Apex Pro is a really, really good club. And I even think with this club, it looks like the kind of club that I could control the trajectory a lot better. Just a nice low on there. So if you're a better player or somebody looking for a, a better player's set of irons for end of 2015 and going into 2016, definitely for me, Callaway Apex Pro is an iron that you should be looking at. So thank you for taking the time to watch the video, guys. Um, leave any comments below. Let me know if there's anything you guys would like me to test. Um, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Uh, lots more videos on there. 
Uh, lots more, hopefully, interesting com uh, content coming up as well. Uh, follow me on Twitter and Facebook. Um, hopefully see some of you guys down here soon. Uh, please stay in contact. Hopefully see some of you down here shortly.